So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and here we'll talk about the arcade facilitator program. So what are the key benefits? What is the program about? How we'll get the cool swags? How we'll get the bonus points? Who will be getting the swags and bonus points? We'll cover all these things. So before we start make sure you hype the video, subscribe the channel and like the video too. Now here let's come to the arcade facilitator home page and let's discover the program. So just like the arcade program here we'll be having the arcade facilitator facilitator program and it also has two cohorts okay so just like the arcade program which helps from january to june first cohort and second cohort which is currently running is from july till december and after that yes you know that the new cohort will be starting in 2026 only so here the new cohort of the facilitator program will be beginning on april okay april he may start earlier also but when it starts I'll make a dedicated video so what is the facilitator program it's just like the arcade program here also you get some badges you have to complete and in return of it you get some cool swags and prizes and if you are a participant you are getting some bonus points so in the arcade facilitator program also there are two kind of people one is the participant and one is the facilitator participant is who completes the badges okay just like you are completing all the badges over here in the arcade home page all the game badges you are completing but here in the facilitator program we have the facilitator facilitator in simple language you can say instructor or teacher in your school or college you must be having some faculties or teachers who are guiding you particularly in that domain or subject. Similarly, for the facilitator program, we have facilitator who will guiding you throughout the program like helping you to get credits, lab solutions and some queries if you are facing like your points are not getting updated or you are getting incorrect reports like this and how you can reach the maximum points. So they will be guiding and if you want to join under any facilitator i'll recommend you can join us and i'll be sharing the most hardworking facilitators url and form we have multiple sets of facilitators already with us and we'll be sharing their details you can just join in with them only once the form is live i'll make a dedicated video how to fill the form also do not worry about it now here if you are still you want to become a facilitator only okay you want to become a facilitator you have participated multiple times and you want to become a facilitator for them also you will be getting some cool swags if you want to see what kind of swags the facilitator will get here i have made a video you can see these are the cool swags okay these are the swags the facilitator facilitator will get and not the student okay not the student students won't be getting this kind of swags but the facilitator will be getting and one more important thing if you want to become the facilitator how you can become i have made a video how to become a facilitator you can just watch this video i have explained each and everything and like how you have to fill the form how you have to become it a facilitator also and this form is regarding 2026 so many of you are saying 2025 is running then how will become the facilitator in 2026 so the event will basically start from 2026 only as the enrollments are closed for 2025 so before that they start the onboarding process like nomination process begins once the event is closed so make sure to fill as soon as possible if you want to become a facilitator do watch this video i'll link the video in the description you can check it out now here we have covered how to become a facilitator and what is the major difference participants participate under a facilitator and just earn some cool bonus points and the facilitator leads the students and gets some cool rewards which you have seen already now what is the bonus points criteria here we have to just follow this thing if you come to the arcade home page you can clearly see all things are same like here okay except the milestone now here we have to complete some milestone over here here in milestone it means that you have to earn some points like you have to complete six games five trivia games there will be game hosted each month you have to complete this and 14 skill badges for skill badges you can check the description box of this video i've shared the sheet you can use it without any issue now after that you have to complete laugh recourses now what are laugh recourses the laugh recourses include some 
quizzes like you have to just check the module and just complete some quizzes and it is very easy complete solutions is already available on the channel and if they update i'll make it as of now you don't have to participate in the arcade facilitator program as the enrollments are already closed i'm just sharing about the information of the event so that you understand each and everything before we begin so here you can see we are getting for milestone one we are having 20 points so many people get confused we are having 20 points can we claim the swags so technically here we are getting bonus point as a participant as a facilitator you'll get the swag but as a participant you are getting 20 points but here you can see if you consider today's uh, latest 2025 point matrix, it will be updated next cohort. Like maybe it changed to 30 or 35. So here you can see 25 points. So you need to do five more points by any means. Like you can do 10 skill badges also, five trivia games also, five arcade games also. Like this you can have. You can have multiple ways to complete the patches. So like this you can see, similarly all the milestones are here. So you can just understand all these things. Now here for facilitator program, if you are becoming a facilitator, then there are some rules for just getting onboarding the students. So what are the rules? Here as a facilitator, you need to onboard minimum 100 participants. Okay, minimum 100 participants you need to onboard and when they complete uh, complete some batches you'll be getting a different milestone okay you'll be getting different milestone according to that milestone only you have to follow all those steps like you have to help the participant to complete badges and as more and more number of participants complete the badges you reach the your particular tire milestone and then you'll be able to claim the swags at the end of the program okay for facilitator it's very easy and just gather some genuine students only and for that also I'll make a dedicated video for facilitators only like what they have to do what is the current onboarding process what is the nomination process all things will be covered in a dedicated video here we are just talking about the participants from now onwards so like here you can see we have achieved the milestone now after achieving the milestone what happens now once you achieve the milestone like you have achieved the ultimate milestone okay now here you can see you have achieved ultimate milestone then you are having particularly 65 points or 64 points let me see how much points we have 46 and 25 for it okay so 46 plus 25 71 point so we are having 71 points and here if we come according to the previous tire you can see only four points are remaining four points are just remaining for uh, achieving the champion tire and if without facilitator program you complete it so you are having only 46 points okay you are having only 46 points so you can see how much the jump is from here you jumped directly to two tire okay you can see from two per you directly jumped with the help of facilitator program with same effort you jump to the champion tire not exactly champion tire but you cross the ranger tire but it's very easy to earn more points than from 45 to 75 i hope you understand so this is the way the facilitator program helps us to earn bonus points and all the criteria i have explained the enrollment forms whenever it will be live i'll make a video here a form is live you have to just enter your details and select a referral code or you have to just enter the referral code or it is auto assigned to you so like this you have to understand each and everything if you have any query you can let me in the comment section another important thing if you want to become a facilitator you can watch the video which i have shared in the description box and that's all about this video thank you guys have a great day ahead 